Welcome back to the next episode of Wargroove 2. As we jump back into the campaign, uh, we did complete that prologue, got all gold stars. We're on bronze right now, I guess, because we haven't completed all of them, but... Uh, we are in the Isle of the Florence here. You can kind of see the map and stuff, although I wish the map had, a, like, other stuff to go and see. Man. But anyway, we did uh, the three stars the first one. I went back and got three stars on that last one after uh, I didn't check the overview right away, which was a mistake. Rom and Lytra find an ancient settlement deep in the gloom woods. Okay. So remember, these Lytrans are still looking for more cacophony artifacts. They don't really know what they are, but they're doing this on behalf of a, an ally. They keep referring to them as allies that have an abandoned settlement. That's a settlement? Uh, some somebody's paying them to go and get these these artifacts, right? Would never have found this place without your sound device. Oh yeah, she played the harp and led them here. General Nadir, we found something. So what? More ruins? The seal on this door does not match the rest of the structure. Ah, it's a door to go underground. It is still ancient looking, yet it must must have been placed after the kingdom fell. Keep us out, to keep something in? Yeah, let's open it. Oh. Can you open it, little I'm soldier? No <laughs> I'm no amateur. I'm a pro harp player, suddenly. Is she a monkey? She's got a, is that a tail? She's got a really long prehensile tail there. Looks weird. She's, she's a mouse, I guess, but. Yeah, for some reason I keep thinking they're like rabbit people. They're mice, they're mice. Wow, she really knows how to play that thing. I presume for lore purposes that the harp is, is controlling her hands and playing the instrument for... Like she doesn't, you know, she didn't need to learn how to play it. Sorry everybody, not to worry, try once more. So it didn't open, there's no ru- Oh, hold it. Uh oh. Oh yeah, right, Nuru. You're the ones who've been wreaking havoc around the forest, huh? Last chance to leave peacefully. Oh, we're gonna have to fight her now. General Nadir, our orders. Our allies- uh, Yeah, the allies were quite clear. The tree folk are not to deter us. So they keep referring to these allies. I don't- I don't know. If you tend to fight, you'll find us more than capable foes. Yes, fine. Don't say I didn't warn ya. Oh wow, trebuchets? Okay, yeah. Swordsmen fall back now. So trebuchets are long-range units that do massive damage, uh, like that. Oof. Nice one, Romb. Watch your men get slaughtered. That's on you. Their blood is on your hands, Rom. Plenty more where that came from. You have no idea who you're messing with. <laughs> she, she talks a big game. She was like this in the first game, too, Nuru. She's like a wild, like, I don't give a beep. She just, like, messes with anybody, doesn't have any chill. If we can defend this position, can you concentrate on opening this gate? I think so. Yes, I can do it. Okay, so we have to defend her for some number of turns. Don't worry, little soldier, I shall protect me, I know. Thank you, Rob. I won't let you down. Okay. Um... For an opening strategy, how about a squadron of spearmen? Oh, four spearmen. Or cavalry. There, is this how every battle with this guy is going to go? Or two cavalry. Four spearmen or two cavalry. Well, I can't move the map. I, I would like to look at my opponent's position and talk about exactly how we're going to approach this. Um, hmm... Normally against trebuchets, I'd want cavalry. Cavalry are going to be way more effective because they will be able to traverse the entire range of the trebuchet. Like, I, I'd like to show you on the map here, but I can't. And smash the trebuchet. Like, basically, they can start from outside of the trebuchet's range and move all the way in and hit the trebuchet in one turn before the trebuchet can shoot them, right? Trebuch trebuchets can't shoot around, like, directly adjacent to them. Uh, or something. I, I think it's just one space adjacent. Or two spaces? I can't remember. Um, and, uh, yeah, anyway, so I think cavalry is better. Four spearmen? That's a lot of spearmen. That That's, like, perfect. Like, three spearmen would be terrible, but four spearmen? 
I should just do cavalry here, right? I can't even right click. I can't I can't do anything. It's kind of annoying because I, I would like to see like what are my mission objectives here and stuff. Like if I have to capture a bunch of towns, I'd rather have the spearmen, you know? I think cavalry is the obvious choice. I'm gonna go with spearmen. I think cavalry is what you're supposed to like the the easier way to do this is probably taking cavalry. But I yeah, we'll see. Yeah, good choice. Fari, remember, we're stronger together. Okay, two pairs of spearmen is going to still be very good, and it'll help us capture things really quickly. So, 12 turns. Uh, let's check this. We should do this every single map. Defeat Nuru. Okay, so beat their general. Wow, win without without using any cavalry unit? <laughs> so, they offer them to me at the beginning. I randomly didn't pick them, and I think I would have had to... I would have had to restart. Wow. That's dumb. Why would they do that? <laughs> so, okay, I can't buy cavalry either. Shit. Uh... And instead of just protecting her for 12 turns, they want me to actually kill the enemy general. So how can I do this? They have a base. Wow, they start off with another base over there, so they're going to be pushing from this left flank as well. And then I have a base on this flank. So the, the battle is going to kind of go clockwise, right? We're going to be producing units on the right flank and heading south. They're going to be producing units on the left flank and heading north. But, hmm. If I can cut this here, if I can take all the towns from this line north... Then we'll starve her out, right? I'm pretty sure I can get these far north, you know, everything on the north north of this river I can get. The three in the middle are going to be tough. We'll have to, well, this one's going to be ours immediately, but those two should be tough to liberate. And then I wonder if I can snag this one and that one. If I can get all of these, that would be amazing. That would leave her with just 300 gold a turn to buy stuff. So, let's go for it. And I've got to beat her within 11 turns. So, one turn early. So, I guess, yeah, because 12, the thing is going to trigger. Yeah, okay. Right. So, these guys go out here. I'm going to grab these two right away with the swordsman. Um, this guy could grab this immediately, and I probably should. Yeah, I should just grab that immediately. And then these guys all come in here. How am I going to beat trebuchets? I'm trying to think if I can lure Nuru somewhere. What if I... Okay, hold on. What if I make a wagon right away? I start with 300 gold here. This is crazy. Put my general in the wagon and just take him right down here and cap one of these immediately. With the general, with the wagon to kind of block... Is actually, I'm gonna try this. This is this might be crazy. So the general jumps in the wagon that just popped out of the barracks, and then these guys all stay together, and that's our turn. Okay. So this is oh they cap immediately, of course. Yeah. Okay, so I, I can take it from that that guy. Like one hit from my general will smash that village wide open. What the heck? I've never seen this part of the forest before. You don't even know your own backyard. This was in your forest the whole time, and you had no idea. Not really your forest, is it? So I could get the... I, I should just cap the barracks immediately. What am I saying? Not the not the town. So, okay. So with that, we will have 400 a turn. She's got five. Yeah, she's got these three. I've got to get those back from her. We're going to take these three and get up to seven, but... Oh, so what am I going to do with the general? I've got to keep an eye on these things as well. Neither of them can reach me right now, and they can't move and shoot in the same turn. Um, they are unable to move and attack in the same turn. Crit hit at max range, that's right. So if you're at the very perimeter of their range, you can... You'll take double, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, and I think yeah. So the, the the shaded squares are where this guy can move, but the 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 transparent or whatever, like the the blank squares, are where he can shoot. 
And as you can see here, I don't think he can shoot. He can't shoot the first two spaces next to him. So these two spaces, this space, any space adjacent and or di directly diagonal, and then even one more, one more space on left, right, uh, up and down, or whatever, north, south, east, west. Oh, this is tough. So I'm just gonna push in here with everybody. Ah, shit. What am I gonna do with this general? Should I plop him down in the middle? I could put the wagon here, drop the general there, and then next turn he smashes. I don't know if this wagon was even a good idea. What if I do something wild, like... Rush this side of the battlefield, drop the general behind here and smash that thing? I'm gonna go for this. One, two, three. So if I drop the general here, next turn he can go one, two, three. I'm gonna have to. F oh, that guy's gonna cap that town. Uh, should I drop him? I could hold him in the wagon, but no. Let's. This is wild. I don't know if this strategy is gonna work, but I'm gonna go for it here. And then I can build. I should just build another spearman for now. Okay, let's see what the enemy does here. They must be looking for more cacophony junk. I thought Requiem was the last of it. No, apparently not. Oof. Yeah, I moved this guy too far forward. I thought this, the spearman behind him was going to be able to get in there and help him. Okay, he's dead. Alright, that's rough. I didn't... Yeah... I thought maybe he would take some damage. I wasn't expecting him to die. That said, we're going to destroy these spearmen now. Ooh. Okay. General's going to have to do a pretty powerful flank here. I think I've got the gate open, everyone. Oh, shoot. There's more. Okay, she she unlocks one of those. There's six. So I guess every two turns, one of them's going to go off. Or, never mind. Yep. Shut up. I'm, we're, we're trying to fight for our lives here. God damn it, Lytra. Um... Yeah. Okay. Come on, baby. I, I think I'm gonna go for this flank. I could even I could even bring the wagon with him and like after this turn just get ready to plow, but like, you know, just have somebody jump at the wagon, move it down here. This guy's gonna come over here and attack me. I think he can probably move two spaces, but with the mountain? Maybe not. Maybe that guy can't reach me. No, I think the wagon needs to go get more reinforcements here. So let's let's solve, or actually, ooh, maybe. Do I grab that one up there? I think I'll grab this one here. Oops, I have 450 gold, and now I have two barracks, so I have to be careful about my spending here. I think I'm just going to make another cheap guy here to cap that thing up there. Okay, this guy crits, finishes him off. Let's start with that. Nice. And then, can I... Okay, hold on, where... Okay, so these guys can shoot right to that woods in the middle of the map here. And then there's a gap here and a, and a gap here. So this is the limit of their reach, right there and right there. One, two, three, four, five... Yeah, five spaces. Does it say... Three to five. Yeah, three to five. Okay, so they can't shoot the first two spaces, right. So this guy goes here. That allows this guy to crit. And I can take out the dude with more strength here. Um, I'm trying to bait Nuru into coming up here. I don't know how I'm going to kill Nuru. All I know is I have to take out these Ballista before I do basically anything else. So I could attack this thing and start trying to free it up. Do half damage and then I take 30%. Or this guy can move all the way there. So if I put the wagon here, he can move, get in, and then I can bring him down here to try and help the other guy. 
I'm gonna do it. Uh, wait, wait, wait. I can go to here. Then this guy can get in. Okay. I'm gonna keep building spearmen here, I think. And our income is rising, so pretty soon I'm gonna start building, like, archer and spearmen at our barracks. Okay, they come in with the archer here, yep. That was to be expected. Oh, this guy wastes his attack, basically, because my carriage is not only pretty healthy, but also um, not in a, a unit that can attack. I don't know who you guys are, but you need to get the heck out of this forest. Simply leave us to our business, and we shall leave in short order. What kind of answers? You're going home! Or, you know, you're in our home. She's, uh, she's a wild card. Ooh, look at this. Look at this. What? He pushed the... The AI rolls this ballista all the way up. So just this guy's mere presence on the left side of the battlefield is causing the entire enemy army to shift left, which is awesome for us. Obviously, this guy is going to be overwhelmed and die. But now I just all I have to do is pull him back. Okay, so this guy gets to cap that. Well, I didn't need that. Hmm. Um, how do I do this? So let me think. I definitely want to smash this thing. How far can she move? Oh, she can't attack that forest right in front of me. So if I put this guy here, this is the weakest guy. So he's not going to attack, but he's setting up the crit for both of my other dudes. So I'm going to leave this swordsman alone. I just want to crit this, this trebuchet and try and get it off the battlefield. Yes, great strike on the trebuchet here. Perfect. It can't retaliate, of course. And then this guy, uh, Nuru could attack this guy, but that's fine. She'll be on a road space, and she'll be attacking an enemy that crits back, but she'll do so much damage that probably won't matter. This guy gets wrecked. More reinforcements. This guy's gonna cap, uh, this. This guy's gonna cap this, and this right flank is wide open. 600? Oh, nice. So I can actually go Duelist and an Archer here. Good. Okay, so I've got the Wagon and my General to move. The Wagon has a Spearman in it. Can't obviously go through there. I could drop the Spearman just on the other side here. How far can this guy move? Uh, let me think. Okay, I'm gonna drop Spearman here. General gets in Wagon. All right, now the general next turn can basically be put almost anywhere. I can move him all the way over and maybe nail Nuru here. We'll see. Okay, hitting my wagon, but this thing's very weak now. Yeah, wagon can take it. And wagon won't be able to get hit by anything else. Our weakest units, of course, in the trees, so they're not even, even able to finish us off. And now too many of their units are on the left flank. Oh, Nuru's going backwards? I need her to... Uh, yeah, she's playing so safe. How do I kill Nuru in 11 turns? I have to bait her with my general so that she comes to my general to try and attack him because she's the only unit on the battlefield, maybe aside from the trebuchets, that can do serious damage to him. Otherwise, it'll take four or five other units all attacking him for, for that to, to be good. Could attack this guy. He's in the water, but it's still not amazing for me. We're gonna take him to half health and they're gonna do 40% back. Yeesh. Okay, I'm gonna hit this village. I wanna cripple her economy if I can. And boost my own. Yes, that crit does it. That was perfect. Okay, how do I do this? Uh, okay, this guy can take him. Since we've got to move the archers up anyway. Get this guy out of the way. Now this guy can take this guy's place. I want to hit this, this thing as well. How do I do this? No, this guy won't be able to get down here. I want to kill the trebuchet. I've also got my general here. This trebuchet, yeah. I can't move all the way over there. Okay, let's just get these guys out of the way. We know what we're going to do with them. These guys have no choice but to move down. This guy can come in here and help. This trebuchet, whoa. That trebuchet can hit that spot, so I'm going to go right there. <sighs> Let me think here. So, 
Like, I want this weak... If this guy can crit, that'll be enough to finish this off, I think, but... Maybe I just bring this... Yeah, we're safe on this space, so I bring this in here. Good, first trebuchet down. That's, that's pretty clutch. What turn is it? Five? We're... Ugh. Ack! We're already uh, not in great spot here. Okay, so this guy comes here, caps, and then this guy gets the crit on the knight, and then Nuru's gonna come and hit my spearman, I imagine? I, I don't know. Nice, that is that is perfect. This is going very nicely, and of course, cluster of spearmen here means it's gonna be tough for my opponent. So I could put this guy in the trees somewhere over here, where this, this guy's just gonna come and hit my village, right? And then this guy can come out and, and hit him. So I'm gonna ambush, wait in the trees, wait for this guy to ambush my village, or attack my village, and then come out of the trees and ambush him from the trees. He'll be on the plains, we'll have an advantage there. Now what do I do with... Ooh, wow. Oh, that's crazy though, right? If I bring the wagon all the way down here, drop the general, that's crazy. It'll pin Nuru. She won't... Uh, can we walk on this water? Hold on. This is river tile. Wow, so units can actually walk all the way across this. It's such a shallow river. This is C. Yeah. So she could actually move across here and get away. Never mind. Uh, man, that's tough. That that's too ballsy. If I put the general right there, with come down with the wagon, drop him off. He's gonna he's not gonna get hit by this, but he's gonna get hit by this crit, the spearman, the swordsman, and Nuru probably. And even though he's in the forest, that's that's not gonna get us anywhere because he can't attack the turn I drop him off. Right? I wonder, do generals? Oh yeah, he's at 112. I was gonna say, does his um here? I'll put it to the other side so you guys can see it. Does his um, groove meter go up even if he's in a wagon? Like, he's, he's still on the battlefield, right? He's still ticking up, but... What do I do? So this guy's range is like this. The only real place I could put him would be, you know, right next to the trees in the middle there. These guys are going to push up hard here. Uh, how do I do this? Do I bring him back down? No, they could just build a big powerful unit here next turn and come at me, right? How do I do this? Hmm. Sorry it's taking so long, but this is why this game's awesome. Uh, it's a sweet strategy game. There's a lot going on. Okay, I'm gonna put him right there. And then I probably... No, let's build another archer. And... I'm going to build another wagon here, too. Use all our money and uh, help our right flank there. I'm going to turbo these guys down here and take these undefended villages if I can. Yeah, as predicted, they attack. And as predicted, we hang on because they're not strong enough to finish that village. That's clutch. That'll be another 100 gold next turn that we almost just lost there. That's the difference between winning and losing these. a lot of these things. Ooh, get wrecked because he's on the road. Nice. Okay, we've got to take Nuru. Now, she's... Not super well defended. They just built one knight and the trebuchet. Okay, now we got to push hard. We have to push hard. That's not ideal. Okay, let's go for it anyway. This is as good as it gets. I've got plus three defense here. They're already a little wounded. Oh, okay. That's not the worst. Okay, so... Um, the trebuchet moved away. I have no idea why. That is crazy to me. I mean, it is just going to be attack with this guy, right? I fear no creature. I fear no creature. Okay. Ugh. Not quite as much damage as I'd hoped, but that's okay. Could put the archer in the wagon, move her down. Let's see here. So this is as good as this guy can... Uh, as good as it gets for that guy, I should say. Mm. So that means this guy crits here, takes him out. Okay, Nuru, we're coming for you. I don't have many turns left, but I think I might be able to do it. Ooh, and there's the groove. 
Okay, let me think here. If this guy moves here, it'll allow this Spearman to crit here. And uh, so it's nice having like this, you know, this wounded soldier, this wounded Spearman unit that I have. It's not strong enough to attack anything, but it's it doesn't matter how strong a unit is, as long as it's that type of unit, it triggers the crit on the on the other spearmen. So this wounded unit's not doing any attacking, he's just positioning in a in a way that lets all the other full strength spearmen attack. Which is awesome. Uh, or crit, I mean. Um Okay, so I could drop this archer like all the way down here. I wonder if those knights are gonna hit me. Yeah, that knight's almost certainly going to come up and hit me if I do that, right? Oh, I could have put... <laughs> I already put the archer in here. I can't change now. I could put the archer over here. It'll just get smoked by their archer, though. Maybe like this to protect her? Now if this wagon dies, I don't care. It'll just absorb one of their attacks and I'm, I'm fine with that, right? Okay, meanwhile, these guys, ooh, push that, yes, that wagon was such a good purchase. Oh, and he can't even protect this thing, let's smash this thing. Okay, unfortunately, we're not going to be able, the swordsmen are weak, but, you know, what are you going to do? Yep. Uh, okay. Okay, this guy just has to come down. This guy was supposed to go in the wagon, but... Uh... I'm gonna build another wagon here, because I think that first one's about to die. Okay, Nuru, show me what you got. I've got six turns left to kill her. I guess five after it passes to me, right? Yeah, hitting my wagon. Yeah. Mmm... Okay, I was not expecting that guy to come over there. Damn, wow, leaving Nuru undefended here. I think we might have a chance now. I guess they're so worried about their economy that they, um, yeah, they get the drop on us here. That sucks. These guys are going to have to lose their lives for the cause, I think. Oh, yeah, you're dead. In the first game, your general picked up Groove by attacking and killing enemy units. But in this game, it's, uh... Oh, nice, they survive. It, it's actually, your groove is doubled. You have two grooves, which I, I don't understand. I think because I'm in the... Oh, little soldier, how goes it? Just a bit more. I'm not useless anymore. I'm not useless. I'm not. Lytra, Jesus. She's got issues. I'll leave you alone. Okay, three more, huh? So... Uh, I was going to say, I think because I'm in the tutorial, like, look, we're at 178 here for Groove, but I don't know. I haven't seen it say anything about double grooving or anything. Wow, so they did not attack my wagon. Hmm. Very interesting. Okay. Ooh, I got to watch that trebuchet. Shit, that trebuchet can shoot backwards still. Is it? Am I in range here? Oh, I'm just out of range. Okay, so this guy can move up, use his groove, then go here, or even better, here, where I can't be attacked by the ballista. But before I do that, how close can I get with the rest of these guys? I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a full strength spearman in this wagon and bring it over. Yeah, we can really block her in here. It's gonna be awesome. So this guy comes down here, uses the groove, goes there. Should I do that first? No, let, let's do other stuff. I might be able to get to 200 groove here before I use my general, right? Okay, this guy just goes here and caps this again, makes them waste more time. Uh, This guy can go here, attack this. With a crit, of course, didn't need it, but... And then this guy can cap. Okay, this has a spearman in it already. Oh, I should have moved here. What am I thinking? Then I could have crit. Oh, I'm an idiot. 
Why didn't I do that? Oh, I just, I just realized that. I was thinking, oh yeah, keep him in cover. Nope. Damn it. Okay. Taking a little damage there, not a big deal. And then this guy... I guess goes there? Okay, the wagon goes up here. Picks up another unit. This one picks up a unit. Drops her here. Okay, let's go for this. So I'm gonna go here, Crystal Heart. That replenishes our movement. It's almost like I get another turn. Okay, their commander is near. Holy! Now ah, we strike. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, I can't get behind her, but this is still good. We're not in range of the trebuchet, and the knight can't really move through the forest very well. Oh, that's it. That's the best I got. That was in... That was in crystal form, too? Dude, that is unimpressive. Okay, let's drop the spearmen here. Using the wagon to block, waste one of their attacks there. This might be good enough. I mean, that... I can't believe... Oh, uh, hold on. I don't want to go... Yeah, I don't want to go within range of this goddamn trebuchet. Uh, am I even strong enough to take this village out? I don't know if one... Yeah, I don't think one sp uh, swordsman can take out one village. Oh, boy. More spears, and... Uh, I've got an archer already in that wagon. Okay, let's see if we can take this general out. This is not going to be easy. Oh, he can get through the fort. Oh, because he moves through his own unit. Yeah, right, right. God damn it. At least I'm still in crystal form, so I'm, you know, taking a little bit less damage. Ooh. Uh, awkward. Okay. Okay. She's at half health. I've just got to kill her. No, not now. Not while others yet rely on me. Oh, shit. Okay, well... I... I don't know what's gonna happen here. I don't know if I can kill her. This is really hard. I have a few turns still. Maybe that, that was a little premature. Oh, that guy doesn't even do anything beautiful. Because all of my units are right next to him. The wagons are super uh, crucial here at, at, at getting within range of those ballistas, right? Or getting under their range or whatever you want to call it. Okay, this guy transforms back, and I'm almost completely surrounded here. Okay, um... Okay, so I can put a Spearman in here. Turn 8, and then we have 9, 10, 11. I think if I dis maybe I can destroy their barracks, that should be enough. Because as long as if they if I can stop if they have to produce units all the way over here, it's not gonna it's not gonna work. So Oh my god, this is crazy. Oh my god. So what I could do is move this Spearman here, and then this Spearman comes over, attacks the barracks, gets a crit. 55? We might even... Yeah, I, I've got to go for that, right? I've got to go for that. I'm going to do this, even though there's a knight right there. Get that crit. There we go. Wow. And I think my archers can actually finish it, right? Yeah, let's do it. There we go. That's huge. We just cut off their troops. This guy attacks here. 
Really wish I hadn't messed with that village now. I'm so weak. Yeah, that's not really doing anything. Uh... Put the archer behind here, I guess? Okay... Well, let's see. This, this wagon... Ugh, I have to pull my general back? Is there a way to keep him here and keep him safe? I don't think there is, right? Uh, 32. Um. Okay, let me think here. Oh, am I gonna pull my general out? I think I will. Um. I could pull him back, heal him next turn. But then... Uh, I might be able to get him back in the fight before the last turn to hit Lytra. Or I could just let him heal passively here. I can't remember. General, I think they still heal again when they're in a wagon. I think that's still something that's... that they can do. If I'm gonna pull back and heal at a village, I'll go all the way back here because my wagon can actually still make it, you know, back into the fight from here. Look how far they can move. It's crazy. They're so powerful. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna drop this guy off. I'm gonna go for a turn of healing and see if we can get it just in time. Okay, so this guy can now hit him. And remember, we just smashed their barracks, so that's huge. They will not be able to produce units here, which I think just cut, cut a major artery. And I... Okay, we'll reinforce. We've got tons of money now. So there's two spearmen here. This wagon is empty. I could put spearmen in wagon. And then come down here. Because I just don't want her to recap this thing, right? And then, yeah, I think I'm going to hit this. And you know what? I don't even care about this village, really. Whatever, let's do it anyway. I don't really give a shit about capturing this. I, I pr should probably save my strength to, to throw another unit, to uh, a full strength unit at Nuru here, right? And they're pouring over the left flank, but I don't care at this point. Uh, I'm gonna get another wagon here just to speed things up. And you see how important these wagons are. Oh. What? Oh, all the way over there. Oops, I didn't even realize I was within range. Damn it. These guys not doing much. Wagons are a nice big roadblock as well. Oh, those guys come that way, huh? Ouch. Okay, yeah, that's bad. Okay, they're attacking. Yeah, attacking my village. Trying to cut off my income if they can, of course. I'm nobody, no, no units over there to help, so... Okay, good. This is the target. We gotta kill Nuru. Let's see if we can get some crits with those spearmen on her. Should be very nice here. I think we can maybe take her out. Oh, this is gonna be close. Turn nine. Uh, and they're pouring over the bridge into the middle here. Okay. Um, so Nuru is the focus here. Yeah, this should, this should work nicely. Um, if I move the wagon out of the way, and then this guy, oh no, but I can't, okay, I mean this guy has to hit Nuru here, 17. I mean, we're gonna do it. She's on the damn forest, so it's it's she's getting that extra defensive bonus, but that's a crit. That's a crit from my spearman. 
Oh, and she's got her thing charged up. Um, I think this guy, this guy's just gonna go here and literally block her. Oh, I can't get in there. Nine percent. I'm still doing it. I'm focusing fire out. I, it, nothing else matters. I'm suiciding all my troops just to try and kill her here if I can. Ugh! Now's our chance! Oh, this guy cannot get in there, huh? Oof, this thing can shoot some of my spearmen as well. I, I want to get another spearman either here, but I can't move here. I can't move this guy and hold the attack and then move another spearman, so this guy's just going to have to go for the crit here. And we're going to do it. Still on Nuru. Come on. Okay, she's not doing much damage back at least now. And then this guy can come here. I want to cut her off if I can. And this guy... Let's just attack the stupid trebuchet. This is a crit because we haven't moved, but our... Yeah, our attack is so low. Okay, and this wagon can't really do anything. I'll just wait over here and block this. Okay, let's get our general back into the... Shit, I can't. Um... Wait, what? Did I not unload him? Oh, so that doesn't even matter then. I, I, I actually moved the wagon last time without unloading him? That is not good. Nine out of twelve, huh? Uh... Oh, wait a minute. Why did I do that? I was gonna... Well, because I'm gonna heal next turn. Yeah, right, right, right. Okay, um... I don't know. Make some random units. Okay, can we finish Nuru? She's gonna summon a unit for free here because that's her superpower. Oh, I should have hovered over her and, and showed you her superpower. Oops. Something fell off my desk there. Okay, this is turn 10 next turn, okay. Ow. Yeah, we knew they were gonna finish one of my swordsmen off. Oh, nice, this guy wastes his attack on my wagon. Nice, because we blocked him in there. Wow, that's a super skinny wagon. When it fell over, it's like, whoa, looked like a cardboard cutout. Okay, so she attacks instead of using her groove? Wow, pathetic attack. Yeah, I think we've got her here. Okay, turn 10. Almost there. Ooh, okay, so let's finish this off. Uh... Get some attacks in here. Might be able to charge up our groove if we do enough damage to uh, to the enemy. Ten. So next turn is our last turn. Just reinforce here then. Okay. This has a spearman in it. This guy's there to just block that guy. Okay, here's a crit. I think this is it right here. Yeah, I think we got it. Wow, awesome. I got all the objectives. I think. Lucky. You got lucky. Nuru! You, you. I'm better than you, Nuru. Stronger, faster. <laughs> and she gets it. Now you get it open, really? Two turns early because I killed the, the general? Right. Okay. Wonderful, let us descend. Oh, suddenly, yeah, what happens to all the Florins who were just there? Several days earlier. Whoa, never seen this place before. You've been holding out on me. Mm -hmm. 
Greenfinger Zawan. Greenfinger is the the leader of uh, all these Florins. Nuru is just a a lieutenant, basically a uh, the right hand of Greenfinger or whatever. These are hollowed hunting grounds. Dangerous, beautiful beasts live here. Beasts fit to train the best of hunters. Grounds meant for one green finger to train another. <laughs> I see what you're trying to pull. I already told you, Zaza, I can't stay here. I can't stay anywhere for long. Why do you think I came here in the first place? So he wants to train her to take over the forest when he's when he, he dies or what? I do not wish to persuade you against your own nature. Consider this a parting gift for all you've done for the tribes. Greenfinger. It's no good for Florin to hunt on our own, Nuru. Wherever your travels next take you, remember this, please. <laughs> Anyhow, shall we? Okay. Well. Nuru! What is everyone waiting for? After them! Victory, yeah! Win without using cavalry, defeat her in 11 units. Wow, we lost a lot of units, but um, we had to, to to get that, I think. Nice. Unlocked a lore entry, Ancient Warning. Additional lore about Nuru. Okay. Ancient Warning. Let none enter this cursed place. Such is the will of the princess. Some kind of symbol, weird glitch. Maiden. Okay, and I got lore about Nuru. Extraterrestrial visitor? She's extraterrestrial? Keeps outer space origin secret from the other Florin. Wow, she's an alien? I didn't know that. Friendly, feisty, clever, and quick-witted, highly valued by Greenfigure Zawan, helped Queen Mercia destroy. Yeah, that, that I remember her from the first game. Nuru's a lively, intelligent, and courageous commander whose skills are out of this world. Unbeknownst to the Flora, Nunu hails, Nuru hails not only from a different tribe, but a different star system entirely. They've stayed longer than intended, but they're planning their return voyage soon. Ah. And her ability is to beam down a friendly unit. Yeah. First charge, she pays full price. Second charge, 25% discount. Uh, at recruit... Oh, recruit structures. So she uses her groove, and then whatever unit she... Oh wait, you pay no cost for the unit, and you get a 25% discount at your other recruiting structures, like barracks and towers and stuff. Wow, that is very powerful. Okay. Let's go to the next one. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this one today. Wow, that one mission took almost an hour. The Florin chase the Fari into the dark unknown. So we go down into these forgotten halls underground, and they're going to chase us. Maybe this has something to do with, the, uh, with Nuru's alien race here. What is this place? Wow, it's dark. Careful, watch your step. Whoa. Wow. Ooh. This looks like exactly what we've been looking for. Yeah, that's a shiny sword. It's so obvious, though. I wonder, is, is this, this has got to be a trap or something. What? We should scour this place, take as many notes as we can. Is this, a, this is, this, if I know anything, if gaming has taught me anything, that is a healing potion. <laughs> This place is huge. And then leave this forest as soon as possible. That looks, almost looks like a, a cemetery. I hear something behind us. Didn't anyone ever tell you how rude it is to waltz into places uninvited? How good of you to join us. I was beginning to worry. After I kicked your ass outside. You guys are really trying to set me off, huh? Fine. Whoa. You are so dead. Oh my god, really? Already? Just jump right into a battle. Soldiers. Everyone, listen! Oh! What is that? Let us make our way to the chamber at the end of the hall. If we hurry, we can take whatever's there and leave. How do we leave? Is there a back door that you know of? They are blocking the entrance. General Adir, the gates block our path. Break your way through if need be. We must be swift. Do not waste time engaging the enemy until we are close to the final gate. Okay. Get Romb or Lytra to the south chamber. Either one. Oh, I have both now. What is that? Okay, let's check the overview. Reach the objective in seven or fewer turns. Lose no more than four units. Oh. 
reach the objective in seven or fewer turns. So this is going to be a different battle. We're not buying units. But what is this? Oh, Life Song Essence. Replenishes 20 health to your entire army. Okay. And it's on a bridge. It's telling me the landscape that it's on as well. Plains. Some plains. That's forest. Flagstones. On foot or horseback, but nobody else? Oh, weird. Okay. And what is this? Hero's Sword. Unit deals three times the damage, but receives more damage. Oh. Three times, but then one point. So 25% more damage, but you're dealing 300%. That's pretty good. Who do I give that to? Um, could be Cavalry. What a battle. I've never fought a battle where there's items on the map. So as soon as we get to here, it replenishes 20 health to our entire army. So we could take hits. I've just got to be careful not to lose units. So one, two, three, four, five. I can't crit here. This guy can. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this guy can crit this door. Oh, there we go. Items bestow non-commander units with powerful abilities. Non-commander. Okay. Um, I guess I'll get this with one of my cavalry? Equip. God, they've got so many spearmen. Hmm. I could grab it with a swordsman. I think I will. I'm going to try it with a swordsman. Okay, so that guy's leveled up here. Cool. Uh, I want to rename him. I, I don't know how to do that. There was a way to do that before. Okay, let's head to this door. Uh... Yikes. Awkward. Go, go, go. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. So, if I move this guy one space, then next turn he can crit that other door, right? So, I'm just going to move him there. I hope that's okay. Let's see. There, there, there's no horseback units uh, on their turn, no dogs, so pretty slow. Has this place been here the whole time? Yeah, she didn't even know. Yeah, the spearmen are really slow. Archers are pretty slow. So, yeah, and they're bottlenecked there. Yeah, nice. Okay, we should be okay here. So, what were, what were the objectives? There aren't so many of them. We can yet claim victory. Oh, shit. Can those guys cross? Thanks for the advice, bud. She's Canadian? The enemy draws near. Hurry through the gates. What is this? River. So, they can actually cross that green slime. Okay, so let's hit this with our crit from our cavalry here. Whoa. Okay. The room lights up. Go, go, go. Okay, Lytra's through. Not so fast! Whoa! What? Okay, let's check overview again. Seven or fewer turns, and then I can't lose four four units. Okay. Attacking. Attacking. Still, it didn't break it open. Shit. Okay. Okay. What? So she teleports to the other side? <laughs> she can just teleport wherever she wants? God damn it. She, like, she never knew this place existed. How did she teleport into the back room? Maybe she saw through the door once we broke it? Because you can't... The way teleport in any universe works, you have to... Holy shit. Huh? Nuru, where are we? He, she summons a bunch of dudes and they're just like, Where, the, what did, where did you bring us? No time for chit-chat. Get these little gremlins already. Oh my god. 
There's so many. Worry not, little soldier. As long as we keep our wits about us, we shall overcome. Uh, uh, okay, are you sure about that? We have to get into this last room here. There's only one way in, it looks like. The health potion should be good. Now remember, these are forest tiles. These greenery spots, they are going to be high defense. Okay, this guy can't quite get to me. Break open the door from the other side? Probably, right? Yeah. Okay. That guy could attack the forest. One, two, three, four. It's not going to be a crit. I mean, that guy can also attack the forest. Maybe I go out here and, and smash this guy. Yeah, he can't hit me here. I think I'm going to push through the side there. Okay, get the generals in here first. They're our most powerful units. Okay, let me think. Is this guy going to move forward? Ooh, that's as far as I can go. One, two, three. Damn. Planes. Yeah, let's go down here, I guess. This is the guy with the sword. I guess once I give one of them a sword, I, I can't give anybody else a sword, right? Okay, and the swordsman is the rear guard there. Oh boy, uh, yeah, this is gonna be tough. This is cacophony junk, all right. Yeah, I see the purple flags and stuff. If there's anything like Requiem down here, I've gotta stop them. Oh, shit. The dogs catch us. Ow. God damn it. I can't use more, lose more than four units. Okay, that's nothing. Ooh, and that right flank is not guarded. The 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 rear guard here, this rear you you know force is way too strong for us to mess with. But I can definitely punch through the people in front of us. And if I leave maybe one unit back here, just to yeah. Oh, so close. Ah. Uh. Okay. Let's hit this guy. Good. This guy, if I could move there, it would work. I, I, can I get all the way there? If I, but then, I, yeah, it's too late though, right? Okay, let's just hit this guy. They've got zero defense. We've even got one defense here. No crit, but basically wiping them anyway. Oh, I could have used, yeah, the archer, I guess. Uh, how do I do this? This, got the, this guy's got the hero sword. Good. That's big damage. Yeah, that guy deals massive damage. Okay, she should wipe this. Hmm. Wow, I can move there? Yeah, I guess those guys can't hit me there, sure. <laughs> minus one? I'm getting minus one. What is this? Beach? Oh, because this is water? Oh, wow, I didn't realize that was a beach. Hey, she can't even hit me here. So let's get out of the way. And then, do I stay here with the archers and rear guard? Oh boy, that swordsman is gonna die. Oh, crap. Uh... 
should I just keep falling back? Yeah, I can put this guy here. I can get the swordsman back. Uh, these guys are going to pour through here. Okay, let's see what happens here. I've lost zero units. It's turn four? I've got to get somebody down to that room by turn seven. That is really tough. Okay, that guy's gonna get basically wiped here. Maybe I, yeah, I don't send my general down this path. I just, next turn maybe, ugh. Okay, this guy's gonna take some hits. Ouch. Okay. This guy does nothing. Okay. Yeah, and they're very slow up there. Let's get all the way down if we can. I've got to rush basically as fast as I can to do this in seven turns. Which is kind of what I'm supposed to be doing anyway, right? I just have to get one hero into the room. No other units matter, right? Okay, so I can hit this. Consume, yeah. I had the option to consume that potion, but no thanks. Okay, wreck that guy. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Damn it. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, if I move here, I can hit next turn. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can't hit from here. Oh, let me think about this. Oh, she's got her groove, which flings enemies into the abyss. We put this guy in the ocean, basically. Uh, or no, he would end up here, right? Okay, I'm just gonna hit this guy with this guy. Wipe these dogs. I think I'm gonna have to get in that room using something like his combo here. But let's see. We attack here. Get this guy out of the way. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it's so close. Maybe I should do this. Yeah, that guy won't be able to hit me. No, I need these knights to hit the the door, right? But I don't know, I think my general actually hits harder than the knights. Oh, this is tough. Okay, let's fire here. This guy can take him out. All of these things are buffing, bumping up my, uh, this thing, yeah. Groove, my groove. This is the, the unit that does 300%. Oh. I'm not sure what to do here. This door has 100 health. I'm gonna go grab this potion? To heal these guys? We're gonna lose this guy for sure. Uh, next turn, when my opponent attacks us. One, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, this guy is gonna be able to go there next turn, right? So. Hmm. 
This is tough. One, two, three, four, five. So, yeah, I need to start here. I should have thought about that. I should have moved this guy here last turn. I'm going to consume this. Okay. This guy waits there. That guy's got the sword. Okay, turn five. I only have two turns to do this. It's going to come down to the wire. Oh, hitting my archers. That's rude. Okay. Going for my back rank dudes. This guy's probably going to die. Yeah, dogs are really good against soldiers. Okay, one unit. Oh, no. Well, at least these guys have defense. Ugh, these dogs have good movement, too. Okay. This is going to go badly for my opponent. Mm, compared to... Oh god, that's bad. Oh, holding. Okay, two units down. Uh-oh, I can't lose more, more than four or four or more. I've got to double check. Okay... Nuru running away. Good. Stay out of my way. Okay, so this thing smashes for 56. Yeah, nice. Good crit. General, the gate! It won't budge! One, two, three. Yeah, let's just smash this guy. Oh. Okay, not killing him. So... I'm gonna save this guy's thing. Wait. I think I just need to run away. I don't want to lose four units here. That would be brutal. If I get there in seven turns, but then I fail because I lose four units. Oh my god, actually, we're gonna die. I, I, I just realized I'm gonna fail this. Okay. Because I don't think I can do this without the four units thing. Okay. General's battling. Where'd you get that weapon? Uh, a convenience store? <laughs> what, you cheeky little? Okay, this doesn't matter. Those knights are gonna get out of the way anyway here. This is the problem. Oh, man, no. Oh, hanging on, oof. By a thread. Oh, crap. Okay. I've lost two units, right? Three units. Oh no. Okay, these guys die. Brave, but foolish. Okay, nobody else can get through. Good. <sighs> okay. Let me just check this, oops, uh, let me just check this overview again. No more than four. No more. So I can lose four. I've lost three already. Uh, okay, just attack here. Maybe that was dumb. I think I'm gonna get in this, this turn though, right? I'm gonna get into the, uh, the room. I'm gonna use Crystal Heart here. Yeah, he's already at over 214. Look at his, look at his groove, 214, but I can't do the level two. Maybe, maybe you just can't do it in the tutorial, I, I don't know. Okay, extra damage. Smash it. Stubborn thing, I must hurry. Lytra. What? I didn't break it? Okay, hold on, attack the door. There we go. General, commander, this way. Ooh. Lytra gets in. Yes, we did it. Oh my god, we got all our accomplishments. Yes. 
Nowhere left to run. One could say the same about you, my dear. Oh. Madam Pistol. I'll fight you too. I don't care how many of you there are. <laughs> yep. Combat. Oh dear. Well, that does sound fun. Don't you have a forest fire to attend to? What? Oh yes. On my way here, I could have sworn part of the forest was set ablaze. Nuru! Smoke! Smoke coming from the great tree! Wow, arsonist. Well, I'll be. I'd hurry if I were you. Fire must be a dreadful thing for creatures made of leaves. Wow, she's evil. Nuru disappears. Pistol. Madam Contractor. <laughs> Madam Contractor. Where have you been? What have you done? I caused the distraction. You're welcome. You're welcome. Pistol, you came back. Of course, dear. If someone had defended me earlier, I might not have left in the first place. But that's neither here nor there. So she's passively aggressive. Passive aggressive attacking my, my character. Now should we finally do what we came here for? Maybe. Okay, yeah, we got three stars there. Nice. Uh what 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 did they say? What what did it just say for me to do? Talk? Look, put people! Or at least they used to be. I wonder what happened. So dead, yeah, skeletons and stuff. No signs of a fight took place. And I can't imagine they stayed here on purpose. We have a word for that back home, friend. Accident, says Tago. Oh, right. What kind of accident would happen down here? Good question. Talk to the spearman. Hey, Lytra, look. A chest. Oh yeah, shit, I didn't even notice that. Wonder what's inside it. Good question. Uh, should I touch that yet? Yeah, let's touch it. Oh. oh, what's this? Congratulations, you unlocked a lore entry. Festival flyer. Oh, huh. Guess they do have books in Arania. Good for them. Good for them. Wow. Weird. I I've never done like a... This kind of movement outside of battle is very strange. I wonder, what was the purpose of this chamber, says Tarsus. Such a grand entrance, only to lead to this. Any thoughts? Back in the hall, everything was so echoey. But everyone's voices sound so much nicer in this room. Maybe people came here to talk. Or play music. Music. Ah, it's in... Yeah, this room is soundproofed, right? I built such a place for that. Talk to this guy. These flags. The purple ones are cacophony. The others likely Silmore. Perhaps this was a meeting place between the two kingdoms. Oh. Yeah, purple is cacophony, the gold is Silmore. Maybe a meeting to end the war, maybe. Look carefully, little soldier. Not a scrap of jewel jewelry on any of the deceased. Not even a hint of weaponry. These people were commoners. This must have been well before the war. Or they were looted. Were cacophony and Silmore friends back then? Aha. Uh -huh. Any other chests? It was just that one, right? I can't investigate any of this stuff. Okay. Pistol. Hey, hey, madam, uh, about the other day, I'm busy, Lytra. Oh, okay. Um. <laughs> I believe we're all ignoring the owl in the room. Huh. Whoa. Pulls off the tarp. Rom. Incredible. A crystal. It's beautiful. Whoa. Did anyone else hear that? Something in the crystal. It's singing. Uh oh. No. Leave her be. It's clearly working. Is everyone unharmed? Let us exit the chamber. We've seen enough. No. What just happened? What have we learned here? I have no idea. This place dates back to before the war. To a time when Cacophony and Silmore may have been friendly. 
but something happened to sour their relationship. It may have happened in this very room. The discovery of a special type of crystal, a power that resonates with music. Perhaps this power caused an irreparable rift between Cacophony and Silmore. A plausible story, but we've yet to find what our allies seek. The secret to harnessing Cacophony's power. Wait, don't you study crystals, madam? Can't you figure out how these ones work? Oh. oh, I'll be taking a very close look at what we found. But I'll bet Cacophony's crystals are made of tougher stuff than ours. If we could find Cacophony's royal palace, I'm certain we'd find everything our allies need and then some. Madam Samtal Ras is correct. We have learned much, but not enough for our allies. We mustn't provoke the ire of a nation so powerful. Not when the Republic needs their protection the most. Our allies. They still haven't said who that is. Our mission continues. Interesting. Oof. Gloomwood's great tree vicinity. Burned down. The fire. We stopped it. Wow. That is not going to help our relationship. That's a relief, huh? <laughs> Ever the optimist. Nuru, what is going on? <laughs> Green figures that one never gone this long. Rosin is scared and Nuru not helping. Nuru just yell orders and laugh like everything okay. Rosin doesn't like this Nuru. This Nuru fake. This Nuru hiding something. Whoa. Very astute swordsman. I'm sorry. It's just because... It's my fault. It's my fault, Greenfingers. So Greenfingers been gone now. This is, yeah, this was years earlier, right? It's no good for Florin to hunt our, on our own, Nuru. Or days earlier? I can't remember. Wherever your travels next take you, would that you remember this. Anyhow, shall we? Remember what? The hunt they're going to go on here? Our final hunt together. Let us cherish the moment. Let's go massacre some innocent woodland creatures together and cherish the moment. Greenfinger, I wanted to tell you something too. It's about where I'm from. Where we're from. Oh, wow. What? Nuru. Our prey is just ahead. We must be quiet. Is he from the same place? Maybe I should just show ya? Uh, but he doesn't know he's an alien? Where I'm from. We've got way better weapons than sticks and staves. Nuru, careful. You'll startle... Nuru! What? Hang back, Zaza. I've got this. Nuru! What? Whoa! What is happening? Great figure! Nuru summoned something. Your wound. It... It's bad. Beast. Poison. Not much time. Nuru, there's a sacred place, an ancient place of healing. Deep, deep. Okay, okay, let's go. I, I'll i take you. No. That is one place you cannot go no matter how dire. So why did you just tell me about it? I shall... Uh, I shall get there myself. Please... Check the others in my stead. Wow. So he goes off to heal himself. It's my fault. Yeah, what did you do? That's why I've got to be the one to fix this. So she tried to summon something, because that's what she does, and she summoned some the wrong thing and it attacked her. Attacked um Greenfinger. Hunting alone, not good for Florin. What did you say? Rosin knows Nuru helps friends all the time. Friends who would help Nuru too. If Nuru just ask. You're right. <laughs> Man, I'm such a dingus, huh? If we're gonna get through this, it's gotta be all of us. Shoot, Mercia might already be in Heavensong by now. Rosin, Gildan, take a floaty thing to Heavensong Palace. Looks like we'll have to invoke our treaty with Empress Tenry. Sweet gum. Sweet gum? See if there's anyone in Cherrystone who can help. Is that the person's name? Those furballs ain't getting away with this. We're gonna stop them. Together. Okay, a war. Now they're calling on their allies to start a war against the Fari here. Unlocked a lore entry, festival flyer, Greenfinger Zawan, and Rom. Ooh. Her loyal assistant. Okay, hold on, let's go back. Uh, Codex. 
Zalan? Green finger of the Florin tribes, beloved ruler of the Florin tribes for the past 90 years. Strong, compassionate, manipulate plants at will, currently missing. Rules the Florin tribes with strength and compassion, born with the ability to produce and manipulate plants at will, an ability uncommon even for the Florin. Once a generation of Florin with the potential to become a green finger is born. Oh. Down trade under his predecessor, Green Figure Russum, for 22 years. Yet when Russum died at the age of 212, Zaun felt there was still much to learn. Though a new Green Finger is not is yet to be born, Zaun has taken on a young protege, Nuru, a visitor from a distant tribe, to enjoy thrilling sparring matches and hours long discussion on life. It will be a sad day indeed when Nuru goes back to her home, wherever that is. And then he can make vines appear on the battlefield. Yeah, this is the same ability from the first uh, game, which is really good. Grow five thorny vines within an eight tile radius. Thorny vines must do damage or something? Vines deal 25% groove damage to adjacent enemies when spawned or repositioned. Wow. Interesting. Uh, we got a festival flyer. Opening ceremony to take place at the Odium. Arrive early for good seats. Invocation. Dance of the Divine Silence. Chant of the World Song. Joint Song and Dance. This year, Cacophony's part of the ceremony will feature a surprise from Queen Maestra herself. That was the flyer for the very last show they put on there, and I don't know what happened there, but... We also learned some stuff about Rom. He's the leader of the Fari Armed Forces. The rest of it is redacted. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. Uh, I wish it showed a mark on which stuff is new. I learned three lore things. Festival Flyer, was it Ancient Warning? No... Festival Flyer... Oh, I guess it was, yeah, Zaw Rom and Zawin, right? Okay, that's fine. Okay, I think that's where we're going to stop today. Excellent! Two three-star missions. We're, we're batting a thousand right now, which is great. That's going to stop at some point. I think we got pretty lucky those last two battles, but uh, we'll keep trucking and uh, hopefully see you in the next episode. Peace.